Back again. We're making um, treats today for the Christmas holidays. Tracy Steen here, of course. Mm -hmm. so. um, right now, I'm going to show you my recipe, or not my recipe, but where I found a recipe for Good enough cook cookie dough treats. Okay, who does not love cookie dough ice cream? My or kids cookie dough, period. Steal it all. Right. Now, now it's my turn. To eat my and own. as soon as you tell them it's cookie dough, they're gonna eat it. Okay. Okay. Good. So what do we got? We have cookie dough treats, clumps, bars, whatever you want to call them. I'm okay. gonna call them clumps. <laughs> Maybe not clumps. <laughs> okay. So what we have, I put in there was some agave syrup, and I'm I'm very vague on how much I'm putting in right now because we're just gonna put the portions below. Yes. On the yeah. YouTube. Look below. You right down. Look below. See. Right, right down, down there. It is. Little there little we go. Says more. <laughs> okay. So we have agave syrup again. Okay, we got some organic peanut butter. Okay, smooth. I prefer smooth. I don't do the crunchy thing. Um, and I picked up a no stir today. Okay, oh. so I don't have to stir it. There's a no stir? Yeah, no stir. No stir. Yeah. I've stirred it for there you. There you go. And I'll move along. <laughs> and <laughs> a little bit of almond breeze. Okay, so I get the unsweetened almond breeze, vanilla. Yeah. Calories low. Yes. A little bit of quick oats. Um, I got some walnuts. It called for raisins. Leslie doesn't like raisins. Ew. Yeah, and um, that would be gross. Thank you. That's what I thought. Uh, I, in this, I think it would be, but this is high in psyllium and we've got some good Walnuts are fantastic for you. So you throw some walnuts in there. And that's what I did. Um, as well as a protein powder. So whatever vanilla protein powder you have. Oh, good. Oh, you throw chocolate if you'd like. Sure. I guess. Chocolate, right? Chip yeah, cookie dough. Goes with it. And it called for chocolate chips. So what I had was some dark chocolate at home, like 80% cocoa or whatever. Yeah. Um, and then I put it in a little baggie and I crushed it up to give me my chips. So whatever you have for chocolate, right? Um, and this, this is what they have. look like. And we just sweet as Christmas it up with a little bit of crushed candy cane, right? Yeah, so I took some of Tracy's little crushed candy cane, put it on there, and it looks delicious. I mean, you could put a little dollop of uh, Greek yogurt. If you could put some Cool Whip, mix the Greek yogurt with some agave, like whatever, get creative. I'm just thinking, I'd put this in a bowl, sit in front of the TV, watch TV, and feel like I'm just having this treat. Yeah. Eat it with a spoon. Just, yeah. And right? it tastes so good. Okay, let me go get a spoon because I'm oh, so sorry. Yeah. Um, because um, it is a little messy here. You do it, Chase. Okay. Hey, you talk. I'll eat. I'm, yeah. I'm okay with that. Good. It t it's very much a cookie dough. Consistency. You can smell it too. It smells like mm -hmm. cookie dough. And it's so it's good. delicious. It is delicious. It sort of reminds me of like score crunches mm -hmm. in there. And that's what it tastes like to me anyways. How is that healthy? I don't know, but it is. So there you go. I don't want to question really it. If it says healthy and I read the ingredients and uh, calories and so on, I'll do it. All right, so that's our treat for today, again, and um, give it a little try. Let us know what you think of any of our YouTube videos or any of our treats. Let us know what if maybe you add something different in there as well. Yeah, and what you want to see more of. Yes, we'll tell us. We're happy to cook. We'll make it. We'll do it. Absolutely. Don't threaten us. Don't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> see you later.